Good day, hello, and welcome. You're gonna be froze out here, gonna be a catsicle. Oh, there's my missy. My poor missy. Eh, say hi to the camera. No, not the, don't tackle the camera. She's like, she's one of those angry celebrity types. Well, looks like that's about to get hooked up. Right, just showed up. I just realized something. I didn't have any videos for you guys today. Uh, yesterday was Remembrance Day. And uh, so I went and did photos for that. That's the other thing I have to do today. Is upload the photos. Uh, yeah, maybe I should go back and get my car. Ah, uh, can I get? I wasn't. I was just wasn't thinking today. I just wasn't thinking. Ah, I'll walk there. I'm gonna come back. Then I'll come upload the photos. Maybe a little bit later. I got other stuff. I got. I got. I got to empty out my car before I take it anywhere. You might find this hard to believe, but my car is actually kind of messy inside. I know. I know. Me. Yeah. Uh, so anyway, yeah. So I figured I'll do a, a walking vlog. It's like a driving vlog, but with feet. See. Uh, so I'm gonna pull up my pants. It is very cold out here today. So they're gonna wire in the heat pump there now. My dad and. Brian, so that'll be uh, pretty good. Uh, they wired up my ants last week, so that's the last thing to do is, is just wire it in and, and then have to figure out how the damn thing works. Hopefully it won't be too windy. Where do you go? I heard him. But anyway, yeah, so... Uh, Answer a few questions. Uh, somebody asked me about uh, where are the photos for my uh, chainsaw. Well, uh, I did take photos of my chainsaw. I did. I did do that. Um, man, that is cold. Today. Holy geez. Uh, I did. Uh, I didn't post them anywhere other than on my Facebook. But um, you guys will. You guys will see some nice photos. Of my 400. <laughs> You're gonna see lots of videos of that thing. I was even thinking about taking it out today. I don't know if I'm gonna have time. I'm gonna go cut some kindling. Uh, it is now Tuesday. And it was supposed to rain all day, so I, I swapped my Tuesday client that I swapped from Monday because of uh, Remembrance Day. I swapped to Friday because it's supposed to be nicer on Friday. Uh, probably cold, but you know, drier. But speaking of dryers, I got some scrap metal to get from my brother's place here. I better get it before somebody else does. Uh, I gotta clean up my car today, get my scrap metal sorted out so I can get it before the snow falls out to uh, out to the uh, scrapyard, and uh, might do some other get some other things done. Hopefully before the end of the month, before the snow flies, we'll see. So the chainsaw, so far it's made me about $300 uh, in, in, like, you know, last week. This week is probably going to be two to three days that I'm going to use it. I'm not going to make big money with it, but, you know, end of season stuff. I almost have all of June's living expenses covered. I still got to get uh, Christmas gifts. And then uh, after that, everything's just kind of like start focusing on next year. Ugh. I swear my pants are falling down. But anyway. Yeah, so other than that, like, uh, I think I accomplished quite a bit this year. Uh, got a lot of uh, a lot of things done. Not You never get everything you want done. But, uh, you know, you keep, you keep plugging away at it. So, obviously, now that, uh, you know, like, I think this is going to be kind of like the last kind of... Well, I'll get three days of work for sure this week. Oops, a uh, branch fell at one of my clients here. I'll leave that for next year for me to clean up. <laughs> but there's something worse, but my, my poor client here, uh, I basically just cut the grass here and stuff like that. But I cleared out all the bushes, little shrubs and stuff that were here. I made the place look pretty good, you know. Uh, I think it needs to be torn down, but that tree, I'm not touching that, that's for hydro. 
I want to show you what happened to uh, my poor client here since the last time <laughs> since the last time I visited and uh, I cut a whole bunch of little stumplings out with the, the chainsaw I did all back there cleaned all that out but look oh my god check this out is he alive you in there I found a turtle Ugh. oh his head's oh he's dead oh he smells bad I wonder what would have killed the turtle Oh, his, uh, his legs and everything are, uh, uh, a beaver wouldn't have done it. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't there yesterday or the day before, so who knows what would have eaten that. Uh, poor turtle. That would that, be an old turtle, too. But anyway, yeah, the beavers have started on their tree. So I'll have to send my client, you know, a heads up that, uh, well, if we're lucky, that tree will just go right there. And if it does, I'll charge a little extra and I'll clean it up because it'll land on his property too. And uh, anyway, yeah. Okay, okay. <laughs> as long as that smell's not on my hand. <coughs> Poor little turtle. Oh, now what would... Because his head was gone. <laughs> I mean, that's pretty, pretty, pretty gross. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So, um, yeah. So that client's well done for this season. Uh, it was done like two weeks ago there, three weeks ago. But I got pretty far into the season. I mean, we're about almost halfway through November. A little over a third through November. Oh, my pants keep falling down. Um, I have to tighten my belt, I guess. Um, so that's not bad usually i don't make it this far into the season but if i could get a little bit more <laughs> you know just to kind of clean up the rest of the season in the sense of uh finances and stuff like that uh because the, the, the longer i could prolong tapping into my uh savings uh for the season the better it is for me because well it, it gives me more income overlap next year so basically anything past june if i have anything saved up past june oh, the sun's nice warm, but, uh, anything past june what it does is and if i have money saved up past then usually by that time i've got income flowing in well enough where it's like a bit of a income overlap now, i busted my ass this year to the point where my body's just Last past two days, I had a, was able to sleep in, and it's done me good. <laughs> you know, it's done me lots of good. But um, I've also uh, like to have an income overlap. Like, there's still things I got to start saving for next year. But the thing is, is that if I can keep working, the more income overlap I have, the more money I have ahead. The easier it is when something pops up such as driver's license renewal uh insurance uh whatever gotta go get parts for my whipper snippers <laughs> you know chainsaws whatever which i think i've been uh kind of thinking about how i'm gonna run my 400 uh the 20 inch bar is probably gonna be the dominant on it there's no doubt about that so the 20 inch bar is kind of like that's the that's the thing, you know what I mean? That's the thing to do. But what I might also do too is, uh, I got a tree right there, I gotta finish cutting the, the, the stumpling. That might be Thursday and then there's a bunch of Manitoba maple way back there I gotta cut. Um, I still forgot to pull out the, uh, the remainder of the uh, horseradish there. I pulled, I dug a bunch out there last year, but it's like, I thought I got it all. No, not even close. It's like, okay, I got to dig that out again. Uh, but I'll, I'll do that in the spring. Um, so point is, is that uh, I think what I'm going to do, because it's going to be a long time before, especially this time of year, uh, unless I get a couple of tree jobs that are like really substantial. Uh, the, the two saw setup I have is pretty darn good. It's pretty darn good. But I only got one bar. Here's that fence I was telling you about. See how many fence posts you can count 
on the way down. <laughs> it's like it's like one post the whole way down. There's like 30 posts there. They're, they're that, that's how well I lined them up. Uh, but anyway, yeah, we'll, we'll do a part two after the store.